On the task 7 page, you need to scroll down to where the page elements layout is and click on the link. That will open up a view only version of that layout, so you need to get your own copy. So file, make a copy. Once that has loaded, you need to do the usual things, put it in your DVC folder and open up the sharing settings. So click on the folder icon and put it in the DVC folder and change the settings to public. OK, once you've done that, you can then start thinking about how you want to lay out these elements on the page. You're not allowed to add any elements, but you're just using the ones that you've got here. So you can start moving things out of the way so that you can make things bigger. So I might want to make that image a lot bigger. And I might want to put these smaller images across the top here. Make sure everything lines up if you need it to line up. It's got very handy red guidelines on a Google drawing so that you know when things are lined up. So I'm just adjusting the sizes. That's not quite lined up. This one's now... that one's now hanging off the bottom of the page so I'm going to move my title and I'm going to drag and hold the shift button down and select all of those all together and move it all up so then I want to put my words back and the words are going to go down here now they don't quite fit so that I can adjust the size of the box that they're in make it a bit taller so all of these things are adjustable on a Google drawing. So you are playing with the elements that you've been given. Still, I've got no room for my title across here. So again, I'm going to select all of those by holding the shift button down. I'm going to make the whole thing a bit smaller. That also gives me a bit more room to play with for these the writing down here and now I've got room to move my title over which I'm going to highlight and change the font so you can choose one of these ones that are the basic ones or you can click on here on the more fonts and have a play with all of the different fonts that are in there so I'm just going to choose one of those I'm going to make it a lot bigger because it's quite small at the moment and I'm going to drag the box out so that it fits. Move it to where you want it to be. Click away, have a look. So once you're happy with your layout, then you can put it up to the Google Plus community and see what everybody else has to say.